Well, good morning, YouTubers. This is Wednesday, the 15th of June. And I'm going to head out to one of the nearby reefs. It's already there's a little bit of ripples in the water coming out of the south, southwest. So I'm just going to go to a nearby reef. We'll see what we can do out there. This is a beautiful day. And in the meantime, while I'm heading out there, why don't you pick up your Bible and read Psalm 37. Psalm 37. Fantastic psalm. Had to tell us what's going on today and what's going to happen. Anyway, when I get out there, I'll uh, put the old sabiki down and get some bait. And we'll see what happens. We'll get back to you in a bit. Well, it was a wet trip out here. Got all my gear wet. As you can see, we're borderline white caps again. I'm hoping that when the sun gets up and the land heats up, that the wind will stop and maybe start blowing that way. I sure hope so, because it's going to be a long trip back in. Anyway, I stopped out here at a close reef. And all I'm doing now is just catching some bait. There's a kingfishing guy over there. He's out trying to catch kingfish. There's a lot of bait on the surface, too. I tried to catch some of these, I guess they're cigar minnows. I don't know exactly what they are, but they won't bite on flies. Not on the old sabiki fly, anyway. So I'm just going to catch some bait, and then I'll get down to the bottom and do some bottom fishing. Maybe catch a mangrove or so. That's the size I like. Nice little guys like this. Yeah. That's good bait. That is good bait. Get back here. Jeez. And I sit on this grunt. Circle hook, you got it. <laughs> All right, first fish, third fish caught. Two lost. This could be the first fish to the boat on a sardine. Let's see if it's Mr. Red Snapper. Yes, it is Mr. Red Snapper. Not Mr. Mangrove, Mr. Red Snapper. See that nice long about five foot long leader I got on there folks I'm after mangroves ah, let me let this guy go this could be Mr. Mangrove I was a little ways off the structure trying to get away from all the little fish and it's awful light color but it is a mangrove thank you lord skunk is out of the boat yeah 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 what's well, a nice mangrove nice grover nice grover i'm gonna measure him up yes sir the skunk is at the boat go right in the lip not one of these monster grovers but a good size one uh. I'll measure them up for you as soon as I get them off. As soon as I can get them off the hooky. There we go. There's that. Since I don't want to get stuck by a fin or a... Come on, open up. I'm just going to have to throw them in the cooler because he's not going to open up. He is... 
35. No, <laughs> he's not 35. He is almost 14 and a half. 14 and a half, that's a good meal right there. Thank you, Lord. Whoop. Action on the old semi beef stick. Oh, I think that was Mr. Shark or Barracuda. So let's go ahead and put this guy where he belongs in the cooler. Thank you, Lord. Water boiling, folks. <laughs> That's bait. Wish I had my cast that with me, even my wonderful cast setting skills. I might be able to catch some of that. Wow. Incredible. But we're getting some action here on this tail. The old circle hook doesn't like to catch them though. Well, this is on the tail of a grunt, a grunt tail, but it has the old red snapper shake. It's got the old red snapper shake. It would be nice if it was a big old mangrove. Looking light, looking light, looking like a red snapper. Where'd my tail at? You eat that whole tail? Oh my goodness. Let me look it down there. Let me look it down there. What are you doing swallowing my hook? Yeah, you got that whole tail down there, don't you? Uh -uh -uh. <laughs> Open up. There we go. Uh. Well, it's gonna take a while. All right, I found one of my little T90 Sabikis. Dag on it, and uh, little itty bitty Sabikis. And I'm trying to catch me, and I'm doing a pretty good job. Some of these sardines, scale sardines. Um. But there's other bigger fish down there hitting the sardine when they get on my little hook. Breaking me off. I only got one of these, but I got a bunch of little sardines. Let's see if I can catch one here and show you what this is all about. I'll show you my catch so far. See all those sardines? Look at them. Oh, we'll put them in, a, in the freezer. Keep them for later. Yep. Ah, there we go. I think I got one or two. Yep, 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 yep. Get them up here before whatever is hitting them down there is hitting them. Look at there. See? Scale sardines because the scales are shiny and they come off real easy. Good bait right there. Good bait. On the little T90. No bait on this uh, hooks at all. Just a little teeny fly. I think they're about a buck and a half or less at Walmart. Love them. <laughs> Live bait. All right, I got a scaled sardine on here. On a, I think it's about a five or six out circle hook. I've lost about three sardines now. There's something smart on the bottom. I'm going to try to catch him now. It's too close to the culverts. Broke me off. Sure, like to get another mangrove or maybe a lane snapper. Oh, see, see what I mean? Dang, go. This was a cigar minna. This was Mr. Cigar minna. Oh, goodness. This could be Mr. Mangrove snapper number two. Yeah. Oh, golly. Ah. Uh, just plain old got off. Dang, got it. Uh. Yeah, we'll see what this is on a scale sardine. Oh, I see him down there. He looks off reddish and white. It could be a meh, 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 a red mangrove. Oh boy. 
No, it's just a red snapper. Just a red snapper. Mm -mm -mm. Not a red mangrove. Just a red snapper. Daggone it, he again swallowed my hook. Yeah, I got another little seagull in on here. Live one. Can't quite tell what's pestering it down there. But let's see if we can get it up. Yeah, I just feel like Mr. Red Snapper. Not even Mr. Big Red Snapper. But it could be Mr. Mangrove Snapper. Looking awful light. And I see a lot of red. Looking awful light and I see a lot of red. A lot of red. A whole lot of red snapper there. Yep. Feisty little guy, not even a big guy, just a little guy. Go on, scram, will you? Bye. Mm. I keep those. Uh... Oh, look at there, blue runner. A bloody blue runner. He's a bloody bleeding. I think I'm gonna leave him right out there in the water. I don't get blood all over my boat. Getting ready to drop the cams down. I'll just let him square himself out there for a while. Feel like a red snapper. Oh, it's just a cobia. It's just a cobia. All right, see if we can get him in here. I don't see any of his buddies. I don't see any. It's gonna be a comedy of errors. I can see it now. Come on. I don't believe it, I still got him. There we go. Ah. There you go. Hey. Hey, man. Yeah, I know. Where's John when you need him? He's sitting home. Him and his wife enjoying sweet tea. 
I barely got him hooked. I hope he's legal. He's close. Oh yeah. 34 at least. Minimum 34. Thank you Lord. Well, let me see if I can get him in this little bit cooler. <laughs> oh, I'll figure it out somehow. <laughs> There's my one mangrove. Yeah. Yeah. All right. There we go. I think it's about time I go home. I'm surprised he was all by himself.